Congratulations to David Benavidez for knocking out Demetrius Andre in the sixth round. This was a 50-50 fight. Andre is one of the most avoided fighters in the world. And David Benavidez didn't just fight the boogeyman. He destroyed the boogeyman. He showed that he has more than just speed and power. He also has skill because Andre was having a hard time finding Benavidez. I told you guys, if Andre can't get Benavidez respect, he's in trouble. It's over for him because Benavidez is going to get him out of there eventually, which that's exactly what ended up happening. You see, the reason why Andre couldn't get Benavidez respect was because he couldn't counter him coming in. Benavidez didn't give Andre nothing to counter. Due to the fact Benavidez showed better defense than Andre and the world expected. So Andre was forced to take turns to let his shots go. However, when he let his shots go, they did not do that much damage on Benavidez like Benavidez did on him. Which mainly was due to Benavidez finding Andre more clearly than Andre found him. After the first couple rounds, whenever Benavidez landed on Andre, he landed clean. On the other hand, when Andre landed on Benavidez, a lot of them shots were actually partially blocked. And that's credit to Benavidez's defense from the opening bell. The fight was competitive. Both fighters were actually doing great work to the body with their power hand. And shockingly, it was Andre who was landing combos on Benavidez. However, as the fight continued, Andre was showing how tricky and slick he is. But by the fourth round, Benavidez was landing heavy body shots on Andre that slew him down. Then he started landing tricky shots of his own. Benavidez was very tricky with his offense, confusing Andre, landing some vicious hooks and right hands. The fight shifted from Andre being the tricky fighter to now all of a sudden it was Benavidez who was the tricky fighter with his offense, dropping Andre in the process. Then from that point, it was really a matter of time. I mean, Andre was really the walking dead the way he was fighting Benavidez. I told you guys in the past, Benavidez is like a diesel engine. Once he keeps going, it ain't no stopping him. Especially when he smells blood. It's over. Which, that's what ended up happening to Andre. He could no longer continue as the corner stopped the fight. I believe in the sixth round. Therefore, congratulations to the Mexican monster who really lives up to his name. Because... You got to respect the fact Benavidez is willing to fight the best. And he's not just fighting the best. He's also beating the best. Therefore, hopefully, Canelo Alvarez will be forced to face the real Mexican monster, David Benavidez. Tonight, Benavidez showed the world. While Canelo Alvarez has been ducking David Benavidez for five years up to this day. With the facts being laid out, drop your thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe below. And to be continued on the next episode of Akhi TV. Peace out. Wa alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.